Hi, Michael. I'm the creator of the Double Espresso series. A couple of months ago, Manuel Bermudez and myself came around that corner in our first espresso ever. It was entitled Injaculation. No, no, I'm not close minded. Don't talk to me like this. I'm just. I, I'm sorry. I'm trying to expose myself to you. Expose yourself? Yeah, one man to another. I apologize. We just went out that day on a lark with a video camera and decided we were going to shoot some scenes that I had written. I think the guy that owned this before was a fucking rage of all of I think he was just filled with anger and, 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 and fear. And I think, I think those fair ones got embedded into the fabric of the sweater. Embedded into the fabric? Oh, yeah. That's what happens. Did you dry clean it? I dry cleaned the shit out of it, of course. Then why did you buy it? And we had no idea that what we were doing would expand into a web series. Move over it so you don't like the food, you don't like the shoes, it doesn't take much to realize that you don't like them. Okay, um, that doesn't make any sense. Caffeinated buzzwords and bites. What are caffeinated buzzwords? He was found dead. Well, I would hope he was found dead. If he was found alive, uh, he'd be knocking on the crypt right now. Let me out! That's, that's the, my point is the expression. There's something troubling about the expression "found dead." You know, it's like it's like somebody found an old shoe in the gutter. I have to tell you, click it or take it. What? Click it or take it. I am fed up with being told what to do when I already know what's good for me. You got a problem with the seatbelt law? Is that your problem? A gay Luigi implies somebody who is straight but pretends to be gay. No, a gay Luigi is a, a gay man with a straight edge or a straight man who has a gay alter ego. You know what? Why don't we just find this Luigi and ask him ourselves? I'm down here in the Arts District, as you've seen. This is one of my favorite places in Los Angeles because they have some great stuff here. This is the last payphone, I think, in the world. And as you can see, it doesn't work, but it's, it's still here. It's nice. Let me show you some of the great uh, posters Julia and graffiti. Hassan poster, The Truth May Not Set You Free. When Double Espresso asked me to help out with their fundraising campaign, I jumped at the opportunity. You can help too. Need to continue and to uh, uh, create a second season of Double Espresso is uh, some uh, sponsorship and some generous donations. Simply go to indiegogo.com slash double espresso to make a tax deductible contribution towards their second season. Here's one secret you won't want to keep to yourself. Go to indiegogo.com slash double espresso and tell them Julian sent you. With me!